Hello guys, welcome back. In previous lecture, we have discussed all about grid alignment classes in Bootstrap. In this video, I'm gonna teach you flex classes in Bootstrap. I have used custom classes, like I have included the background color, height, and also background, I mean border. Each div have our different classes, like uh, row HLs and uh, item hl it means this class i have customized the applied the color background color uh, i mean uh, border color to display the border on the browser i have opened this file on the browser here i will use bootstrap flex classes to check up our uh, display the grid system or flex system right so let's get start to understand first of all this is the output div under this div have a three divs right i will use bootstrap class like um, d flex flex row cell and then open the browser for the page right this is a flex flex row class now the next is flex row reverse flex row reverse used to display the content all content in the right side i use flex first you need to write the d flex flex row reverse say and then open the browser for the page right now the justify content justify content is used to display the content on the center right left between around right i go to below and this is a justify content um, code first i write the d flex flex row right then i will use justify content Start. this is a default class just say open the browser for the page this is a default text I will use another class like uh, center first step you need to write the D flex flex row justify content center say open the browser for the page right now next is D flex flex row justify content and say and then open the browser for the page right and now next is around and between D flex flex row justify content around and finally I will use guys D flex flex row justify content between say and then open the browser and refer the page right this is around and this is a between now the next is flex container and flex column classes so guys i will use another class like uh, first i use d flex flex column say and then open the browser refer the page what is problem guys this is a default right so next is d flex flex column reverse say and then open the browser for the page right now this i mean this is a default uh, display the default data but after using reverse then you are able to see guys the whole content i mean whole borders or whole rows appeared on the below right now the next is vertical align items vertical align items guys i will use first deflex flex row and i use align item start right say and then open the browser for the page right now the next is guys D flex flex row line items center say open browser 
that's the page right now the next is guys I would use guys uh, D flags but I think I need to check the class by the data D flags flags row align atom center that's uh, perfect I think I will uh, use another class flex row align atoms and cell and then open the browser and the page right this is the center okay I think this is a background uh, half gray then you are able to see guys the whole content appeared on the center I do not uh, focus on the uh, background color right now the next is guys another class deflex flex row align atoms atoms around sorry baseline so and open the browser for the page right this is the default baseline and finally is a uh, deflex flex row align atoms stretch save and then open the browser for the page okay this is a stretch guys now the next is self align self vertical atoms align self vertical space guys I will use deflex and then a uh, flex row align self start now the next is first I save the code and then open the browser for the page right now the next is guys deflex flex row align self center save and then open the browser for the page okay guys one more thing you need to do is I just uh, remove it because I will uh, use another class uh, to display the responsive and this is a vertical I mean uh, vertical uh, classes I will use just uh, classes on the each div deflex deflex row and I will use align self start and guys I will use align self and I mean center and align self and align self around baseline finally I will use guys align self best stretch save and then open the browser for the page okay this is the uh, output of the align self vertical atoms right and then finally is the responsive align self first step you need to write the d self flux row and I'm gonna use the uh, I mean responsive uh, flex box so first step you need to assign the class on each day align self and then assign the uh, I mean uh, size I will use MD I mean it's medium and then I will use the position I will use the start and then I will use guys align self MD center and finally I will use not a final but I will use another classes and align self and the best line and guys finally I will use self and the stretch just a minute I change the wire stretch sir and then open the browser for the page okay but I will increase the size 
are so decrease the size of the browser then you are able to see this is a responsive after uh, this is a small screen I decrease the increase the size of the browser then you are able to see guys right so those are different flex classes I hope you are understood as well thank you very much for watching see you next lecture guys